Hey, welcome out to Kawea Creek Raceway for the Vital MX race shop build here of our 2021 CRF 450. Been a long time coming for this motorcycle. This has been sitting down at Pro Circuit for the better part of seven months. They were using it to tool up the exhaust system, build a piston, get a good suspension setting, using it as, a, as their test bike. And so we have been waiting impatiently to get it. Um, when I got this bike brand new, obviously it had the ECU gurgle that was cleaned up through a new Honda map. It had a great motor, a great feeling chassis. It, it wanted to turn real easily. It was, it was very thin and playful feeling, but we could not get the suspension to work. It, it was too soft and something was such with the valving that just, it didn't matter what you did to spring rates, preload, clickers, it didn't matter. It just didn't handle well. So for me, the, the focus of this bike was let's, let's see if we can get this thing to handle right um, with just some, a good suspension setup. So Pro Circuit, like I said, went out and did some testing, came up with this setting. They also had developed a high compression piston for it and an exhaust, so I'm not gonna say no to that. They already had it in the bike. I said, all right, leave it. Uh, I don't need extra horsepower, but I'm never gonna say no to it. I think that's uh, a, a, you know, something that all motocross guys have. It's probably not super intelligent on a 450 to want more power, but here we are. We also went to the, our buddy Chris over at FCP, Factory Chassis Parts. And those engine hangers and mounts make a big difference in, now well, a big difference. It's a subtle change, but it is a positive one. Uh, by going to titanium in the front, aluminum in the rear, it allows the engine to flex a little more up front, which allows it to roll into a turn a little easier. They did some work uh, with several different test riders on this. Freezy did some work with them and a few others. So we threw that on as well. So a suspension setting and those engine mounts. And uh, really we went, we went riding with it. Um, the rest of the bike, it's, Decal Works graphics, Super Sprocks chain and sprocket, all everything else is Pro Circuit on there. We got some Helo Concepts lever grips, uh, and some Works Connection just drain you know plugs and caps and things like that. Dunlop tires is another big one. We we threw my combo on here, which is a 53 front, 33 rear. I love that. If it's anywhere from medium to hard pack, that's my go-to. If it gets really sandy, I'll go 33s or maybe the the scoop, but it's pretty basic. We didn't do a whole lot to it. Uh, moto seat built us a nice seat cover for it really the focus was handling so on the track uh, right away I could tell that it was just a better balance what I mean is that when you go to get on the brake hard it doesn't dive in the front when you accelerate the back end doesn't squat it's nice and balanced you know and doesn't pitch and throw too much uh, it was a little firm I, I opened two clicks on the uh, on the fork compression we had set the sag at about 102 because it was new. Figured that would settle into about 105, which is what I want. And after a little while, yeah, it, like I said, it, everything felt nice. I softened those forks two clicks just to get a little more comfort on the little bumps. And I was, I was perfect. I never had another issue. And I just like kind of the feeling I had of this bike at the intro, very easy to lay it into a turn. Whether you want to just stay on the pegs and stand or sit with your feet on the pegs or actually, you know, throw your leg down and really bury it into a turn. This thing likes to corner. It, it's a fun, fun bike. And if you need to make little direction changes in the air, you just, you just, uh, it's just got an easy pivot where you can just turn the bars and the thing will kind of move. It's just very free feeling. So I love it. I, I just really enjoy riding this bike and probably too much horsepower. I mean, this thing is so fast. In stock trim, it's really fast. You throw this pro circuit exhaust and piston on there and it's, it's a whole shot machine. This would be fantastic setup for Mammoth or something like that or if you're a bigger boy or a pro, uh, I just don't need that much power anymore. But overall, great setup on this suspension. For them to just take a stab at where I'm at, it's pretty much perfect. You know, I can push really hard and jump into stuff and it doesn't bottom, it's got a good hold up. But on the little chatter and stuff, just gobbling it up, no problem. So I'm anxious to get it to some other places and I'll probably need to fine tune with uh, some high speed, maybe some, some clicker changes, just one or two here or there, but I'm really close and super happy. If Honda could come out in 22 with suspension that's even similar to this, uh, you're going to see this bike up front of a lot of shootouts. It's just, it does everything really well now when, once you get that suspension sorted. So big thank you to Pro Circuit. The boys up there nailed it. Wasn't really looking for all the extra horsepower, but that is fun. Uh, I was looking for it to handle. And between those FCP engine mounts and the suspension, nailed it. Uh, so fun. So fun to ride. Just just easy to, easy to ride. I can actually, you know, I talk a lot about my pace is what it is. 
uh, you know, if it's a two minute lap time here, I can do that on most bikes, but it's just how easy can I do that? And on this bike, I could probably do two minute lap times for 20, 30 minutes because I'm just using very little energy. I, the bike's just easy to ride. So for me, that's what I look for, that comfort at my speed, and this thing gave it to me. So really stoked on this motorcycle. It shows that uh, all of the pieces were there except for that suspension component. And if they fix that for 22 or, or beyond, they're gonna have a winner on their hands. So thanks to Pro Circuit and to all the companies involved with this build. We really appreciate it. This was a fun, fun project and we really got the results we were looking for. So appreciate you watching. We'll see you guys on the next race shop build.